the Warriors lose, and now Kevin Durant is a Phoenix Sun. What does it mean? What does it mean for the Golden State Warriors? Real quick, Shasky, let's go to RJ in Fairfield. Been on hold for a while. RJ, what's happening? You're on the roast. All right, what's up, guys? Good morning. Um, man, I'm about to bring the smoke this morning. So, hey, the, uh, the KD move, hey, that's a, that's – that's a move where you got to win the West, man. You better be in the chip for that. Um, so I got Phoenix and, and Boston in, in, in the in the championship. But uh, as far as the Kyrie move, um, I think y'all better be fighting uh, the Phoenix Suns in the West for that. You know, Kyrie, Luca. You, when you have those types of players, man, you got you you got to be at least at the Western uh, championship for that. But I want to bring the smoke real quick. I enjoy when you guys. Uh, you know, coming off a of Warriors loss, I enjoy you guys squirming and, and finding out excuses for these Warriors. But I, I want to make a bold prediction. I want Sacramento, and I want the Warriors. I want the Sacramento Kings in the three and the Warriors in the six. I want y'all in the first round. Mm-hmm. I want to beat y'all in the – I want to beat y'all in the first round so that I could call back because I love you guys. I love when you guys talk about the RJ, Warriors. RJ, 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 RJ. When did Kings fans become chesty? Huh. You haven't uh, won uh, a playoff series in your lifetime, <laughs> RJ. What you got? You better bring more smoke. Do that against the Warriors, man. We gonna upset y'all. I want to. I want y'all. I don't care. If we lose. I want to hey, send y'all home. Hey, hey RJ, RJ, Earth to RJ. You ain't getting the three seed in the Western <laughs> Conference. All right, that, that's number one. Earth to uh, hey, hey, RJ, I love him though. That three seed is God. Because you got it back to back with Dallas this weekend at the Go to One Center, you lose in one of those games, and then guess what? You don't. You go down to Phoenix for Kevin Durant's home debut with the Suns on Tuesday. So you're going to go one and two over the next three games, Sacramento. I do love his his confidence, though. Oh, the confidence is through the roof. I love it. Sac fans being confident. Well, I love that. Well, it's great because you know what? Like like a mushroom, you know, I have they've been dormant for 20 years, and now all of a sudden they're sprouting out after a nice rain. So good for them. You good know, luck, good luck to Sacramento. They play Suns three times <laughs> over their last thirty games or whatever it is. What Sacramento's thirty one and twenty three. They survived against Houston yesterday. That schedule starts to beef up, though. I don't know, Sac. Look, look, you won't end up in a three seed. A, a part of me right now is really disappointed in the Golden State Warriors because the move to make was to get Kevin Durant. I wanted him in the off season. I wanted him during the regular season. I wanted him before. He ended up getting traded to the Phoenix Suns. Like that, to me, that was the move to make was to go get Kevin Durant. I'm disappointed that they couldn't get him. I understand why they would be reluctant to get rid of what they have currently to get him because you'd have to give up what Draymond. I don't think they could have given up well, Wiggins yet. Well, if they didn't sign the extension with Wiggins, yes. right? There's a move, I believe, that could have been made if they didn't give Wiggins that extension, correct? Yes. Because he would have entered the last year of his deal. And you would have had Jordan Poole without the extension, yes. still on his rookie deal. Yes. That would have been a way to maybe try to go get Kevin Durant. But are you cool with trading Poole and Wiggins? And and a bunch of future and first round picks exactly. and probably more. And probably more things. Which it's like people I see this this is the kind of text I get all the time, whether it's on the internet or whatever. You gotta keep Steph and Wiggins and Clay and Dre and Poole and everyone else can go. It's well, like, well, then what the hell are you getting? Well, and, and everyone else isn't good enough to go get Kevin Durant. It, but that's my point. We're talking and about a to, top 10 player all time. And because of the NBA, like I was telling Spadonius, I just think it's the hardest league to, to trade in in terms right. of like, you got to line things up. You can only trade this guy in this window. And once he signs an extension, well, you can't trade him here. And like, there's a lot of caveats. You can only trade so many first round picks in a row. I think it's, you have to stagger them. Like there's a lot of little nuances to it. It just feels like the Warriors missed their opportunity to get Kevin Durant. But again, my thing is like... I, but how do we even know Kevin Durant wanted to come no, back? No, I don't know. I don't know Kevin that. Durant didn't want to come back here. No, but also Warrior fans. I'm talking about Warrior fans. They want it both ways. Some they Warrior want fans. Everyone, some Warrior fans. Some not warrior. All, You're right. Not You're right. You know, all. I shouldn't Let's scapegoat. You're right. Yeah. But I, I feel like I, the over-prevailing thought is, <laughs> we got to keep Clay and Dre and Steph because they have to be Warrior lifers. But but all these other guys that I don't have emotional attachment, they can go and we can get a superstar. But that's not how you consummate a trade in the NBA. You have to line up the salaries. So if you're not willing to move off of those people, you kind of got to just play this thing out. No doubt. No doubt. Shout out to Big John. Got my coffee this morning at Starbucks, man. He picked up the tab. Although a couple of them are online orders. Shashi comes in late with an order. So I stood in line. Shout out to Big John oh, out there. Thank you. Uh, Big thank John. You, Big John. Is, he like, is he really small? No, nah, Or is he Big like John. little John who's no, really big? No, no. That's Big John. Oh, he's, he's big? John. Yeah, he's Big John. 
Big John for a reason. Oh, he's big. He doesn't small about Big John. Big boy. Big truck boy. driver. Truck driver. Well, I think he does. Uh, is he called Rich Driver? Big John, what do you do? Texas. But what do you do, Big John? Uh, he sounds he's like a warehouse. real man. He said, no, he, he goes in a warehouse and he puts us on. Everybody's well, listening to you, us Big and they John. think we're a bunch of wackadoodles. So. Well, we are. Mm. But yeah, hopefully probably. you smile and laugh and scream yeah. and, you know, I evoke emotion. I met Denny Kerr's wife last night. I believe her name was Erica. I look at his Instagram. I don't... Hope I didn't blow today, but she was like, "Yeah, you guys are always yelling at each other." And when I was like, "We actually haven't yelled at each other in a long time." Just yesterday, about Jimmy Garoppolo, and boy, you want to get into what Debo Samuel said? You know what? Nothing is worse than these couples who say they never argue. You're a liar. That means you're like one step away from. You saw White Lotus season two. Yeah, no, no, yeah, no you, I've only saw half of what first. Episode. Okay, well then I won't give it away. But yeah, yeah, yeah. The same thing, like. These people, me and my significant other, husband, wife, whatever, we never yell at each other. Pfft, get out of here. Yeah, it's a fake relationship. Thank you, uh, Bonte. 650. Thank you. Big John working with the Daily City. Spadoni. Spadoni yeah, did knows the, what's up. Yeah, like a he married knows man. He gave the, yep. He knows what's up. 650 Xfinity Mobile Text Line. Daily City Water Department. That's Big John. Oh, yeah. Shout out. DC Daily Water City. Department. Yeah. I know plenty of people that yeah. work in the DC Water so Department. Shout Big out John. Brian Timbo. There you go. There you go. What should the Warriors do? Ronnie, we'll get to you on the other side. 888-957-9570. Kevin Durant goes to the Phoenix Suns. Kyrie's in Dallas. D'Lo, D'Angelo Russell, Malik Beasley, Jared Vanderbilt going to the L.A. Lakers. What moves are out there for the Golden State Warriors? Jacques Capertle, everybody favorite big man. He goes to Toronto from San Antonio. What about Kessler Edwards going from Brooklyn to the Kings? Oof. That's a big move. If he was in a lineup right now, Kessler Edwards, I'd have no idea whether oh. he was white, black, yeah, or something. We, we I have no what, idea what you, he looks well, like. Just, you don't watch League Pass. That's why. Got to get your League Pass up. Man. Bonte, if 100 sports fans were sitting here and we had to identify Kessler Edwards, none of us could do it. Yeah, it's league Pass, if you watch League Pass. Joey you Spadoni, can. you watch the NBA. Do you have any no, idea? He who watches that the is? Lakers. Yeah, I watch the. I yeah. don't watch. Yeah, the he watches pass. the Lakers. Thank Stop you. It. Thank he watches you, the Lakers. He watches Hard enough the staying up only. to watch the Portland game when I'm trying to put a three-year-old to sleep.